Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So just to let you know that if you are using Google Calendar on the web, that Google is now starting to roll out a new look and feel for Google Calendar online. So starting yesterday on the 23rd of October, Google says you will now notice a refreshed user interface in Google Calendar that is in line with Google Material Design 3. So basically that's the material use side of things. So things like your controls for buttons, dialogues and sidebars are now more modern and accessible. So if you look at these buttons, we can see that's a lot more fluent and rounded and material U. Um, interface um, typography now uses Google's custom designed and highly legible typefaces according to Google. So just to give you an example of what this is all about. Yeah, we can see some of that in action, things looking a little bit different. And also the iconography is now legible and crisp with a fresh feel, according to that announcement yesterday on the 23rd from Google. Now, something else that you're also going to notice, and which I'm very happy to finally see roll out, and it almost makes me think why this took so long. They are now introducing the ability to toggle between light mode, dark mode, or device default theme options. So to enable the dark mode, we head to the little settings menu in the top right. And here you'll see a new section called appearance. And there we go. You've got light, dark, and device default. I'm just going to pop that onto device default, which is already in dark mode. And here you can, um, you've got your information density where you can set responsive to your screen or you can set that to compact. I'll just keep it at uh, default responsive to your screen. So I think this is a nice move uh, in the right direction. Just finally bring in dark mode to Google Calendar, which they say will provide you with a more comfortable, customizable viewing experience and can also reduce battery usage if you are using a device that is running on battery. Now, something else to take note of, some additional details, Google says that these updates are applicable across the entire calendar web experience, including if we head up to the task list view. So the task list view is now also in dark mode. So it has the ability to choose between light or dark modes as well for my tasks, which I also think is a nice little bit of an add-on and some, you know, just an, another little additional feature with the rollout of the dark mode. And the rollout pace is gradual, okay? So I've also only noticed this on one or two of my browsers using Calendar. Um, my default Chrome browser that I use Google Calendar on hasn't received these changes yet. So it is on a gradual rollout, starting yesterday on the 23rd of October, 2024. And according to the announcement, I would say that by the middle of December, so maybe just over two months time, by the middle of December, uh, you should start seeing these changes roll out fully if you haven't noticed them become available in your region already. Already, And the availab availability, once again, is to all Google Workspace customers, Workspace individual subscribers. And if you are like me, using a personal Google account, you also get the benefit now of these changes we've discussed in this video. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.